So, um, I have a, so in my story, my last story time video, I told you guys that I got, well, I went to church and I battled and trained in Pokemon there, and I found someone that was willing to trade with me, um, he had this card, and I, whenever I was fl flipping through, it was like, okay, these are pretty cool cards. I saw, like, um, like, um, Full Art Lapras GX, um, some other cool stuff. And whenever I turned the page again, I saw this, and I, and I was silent with my mouth open. I was like, okay. Um, how many cards do you want for this? And he said one, and I was like, Wait, uh, are you serious? This is a rare card, dude. One? He was like, yeah, just not too powerful, not too weak. And I was like, okay, fine. So, um, I got this. This The good things about it is it looks amazing, if you if you would look at it, it looks like it wouldn't be it would be a full art, but it's not. This is um Ultra Necrozma, and the GX is red. Well, the symbol is red. And the cool things about it is it's golden. Ultra Necrozma looks freaking awesome, and it's Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, and it, he's an Ultra Beast. Um. Um, and if you're wondering, yes, um, for some reason I'm watching Dr. Phil. Um, so, the bad things about this card is, it's very weak. For an Ultra Beast, that is the combination of Lunala and Sogaleo, or Sogaleo, whatever it is. And, so, I combine. A combined fusion of Sogaleo, Lunala, and Necrozma, or Necro, or Necro, whatever it is. You get this freaking cool card, but it's weak. It's health for an Ultra Beast Dragon, for an Ultra Dragon GX card. This, well, for an Ultra Beast Dragon type GX card, which is the the fusion of three legendary Pokemon from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, you get kind of a weak card. I was expecting this to get like um like maybe like 190 health is very good. It's it's really good. But there were other GXs like if I just flip through some of my um pages um see my Gardevoir GX yeah that has 230 um Charizard GX 250 even this uh, even this Mega Charizard Y card has that is an EX has 220 health and this Raichu has more health than it, that the Stormy has the same and all of this this is like even my Scizor has more health um, but even though it doesn't have, like, a good amount of health for an Ultra Beast GX, it's still a pretty cool card. It's attacked Phantom G Geisher, I think. Um, if I read, um, this card, all basic psychic energies from this. Pokemon, this attack does 80 more damage for each card you discard in, in this way. So, that's, I guess, I I guess good. It, it, its attacks are okay. So, uh, yeah. But there's also another one. And this one is kind of, well, it's, it makes ultras... Um, Ultra, um, Ultra, really? It makes Ultra, um, Necrozma 
look very pathetic. Tag Team Sugaleo and Lunala GX. Do you see how much health that is? And even though they're tag teams, this is only two Pokemon. This is a fusion between both of these in their ultra part, in their ultra forms, and the Krasma. That's a fusion. And this thing has better health and way better attacks than that. That's kind of disappointing. Well, let's see. Uh, this is um, Sugaleo, or Sugaleo and Lunala GX. Um, I don't know why they just gave it the sidekick typing, even though they should have, like, put, like, maybe... I'm not sure. I know the... I know... Um, the Sugaleo is a steel type. I think he might be a fire type. I doubt it, though. Um, so, like, I don't know why they just put sidekick for Lunala, but, like, because there is things called double typings, like, um, like, there are double typings. So, like, they could have put sidekick and steel... And I don't know why they did it, but this is a very OP card. Cosmic Burn, 230 damage. It does more than a GX move. This Pokemon can't use Cosmic Burn during your next turn. So, basically, you can only do this move, like, once. Light of the Protector, 200 um, damage. If you play Lily's full force from your hand during this turn, prevent all effects of attack, including damage done to each of your Pokemon during your opponent's next turn. You can't use more than GX attack in game or in a game. So these are basically my new cards that I got from training. Um. If I had to choose which one looks cooler, is that one, which one's more better? This one. But, yeah, that's all I have for today's video. So, I haven't uploaded in a while. I've just forgotten, basically. Um. But, yeah, um. So, I um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And, um. I don't know if I told you guys this. I, I'm pretty sure I did. But my goal um, by the end of the year will be 100 subscribers. Just get another 42 subscribers and then we beat our goal. And we should be able to do this because whenever I said I wanted to get to 50 subscribers before the end of the year last year, it was like... I would probably say either in the middle or past the middle of the year. I would probably... No, actually, it was either in the middle or a little between the middle and stuff like that. Um, and we still got to 50 subscribers. And so we should be able to do it again. Um, so, yeah, but that's all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.